Hi everybody, Jim Calverly from Fujifilm and today I'm here to talk to you about the FinePix Real 3D W3 digital camera, the world's only true 3D digital camera that shoots using two lenses and two CCD imagers. And I'd like to talk to you today about output of the, uh, of the W3 digital camera. There's a few different ways that you can enjoy 3D that you capture with the camera. And again, if you didn't know, it captures both high resolution stills and high definition movies uh, on the W3. And there's a few different ways you can enjoy that content. I want to go through those things with you today. The first one and the easiest one is right on the back of the camera. This is a 3 inch widescreen high resolution 1,150,000 pixel auto stereoscopic display. I know that's a mouthful. What that means is it's auto stereoscopic, meaning you don't have to use 3D glasses to see 3D on the screen. So you can see 3D with the naked eye. So you shoot those images, you take those movies, and you can play them back right on the camera and enjoy 3D instantly. It's instant gratification. But eventually, you're going to want to look at other ways to view and enjoy your, uh, your content from the W3. Another way you can do that is by using our photo uh, printing and gift site seehere.com that's s-e-e-h-e-r-e.com at seehere.com you can upload your still images from the W3 over the web and they'll print 3D images for you 3D prints using a lenticular printing process uh, and they'll come to your house a few days later and you can enjoy some great 3D content in prints so that's from seehere.com and that's another easy way to get 3D content that you can enjoy and share with your family and friends. Another way to uh, uh, enjoy your 3D content is with a 3D television. Uh, this year there's been an explosion of 3D TVs available on the market from every possible major manufacturer, from Sony to LG to Samsung to Panasonic and many, many others. All of them are offering 3D uh, viewing on these televisions. Uh, and to view the W3 content on these televisions, it couldn't be any simpler. Uh, it's really quite as simple as plug and play. All you need to do is get yourself an HDMI cable, and this particular one uh, that we're using here is an HDMI standard size to HDMI mini. This plugs right into the side of the camera. There's a little HDMI mini jack right here at the side of the camera. You plug that little mini section into. Then the standard HDMI section goes right into the television and you literally turn the camera on, turn the TV on to the correct input, and you're watching 3D content. It's literally plug and play. It's important to know that you need to have an HDMI version 1.4 cable. That is the spec for 3D, so we, we uh, highly suggest that you uh, make sure that you have a version 1.4 HDMI standard to mini cable in order to make that connection. But if you have a 3D TV, uh, and you have that HDMI cable, it couldn't be easier to watch uh, your 3D stills and your 3D movies truly plug and play. A fourth solution has to do with computer, and there are many, many computer solutions uh, on the market today to enjoy 3D with, anywhere from software programs that will allow you to use it on your standard computer to uh, special monitors, um, but one of the most important and one of the most useful uh, computer solutions now is put out by NVIDIA. You may know the, term, the, uh, the, the company NVIDIA from their graphics cards. Uh, they make some very, very high quality graphics cards at, that range in price from anywhere from uh, $100 up to you know, over $1,000. Um, but they also make a rather clever 3D system called the 3D Vision System. The 3D Vision System comes in basically two different flavors. You can upgrade an existing desktop computer if it's a relatively recent technology, if it's a recent desktop, you can upgrade that desktop computer with the 3D vision system and look at 3D on your current desktop home system. Or there are several manufacturers that are using the NVIDIA system and manufacturing that into laptop computers now. So you can purchase a laptop computer that has 3D viewing built into it and uh, comes with a pair of glasses, or sometimes the, the glasses might be sold separately, um, but you can view right on that 3D laptop. Uh, in that case, you would literally transfer, just transfer the images and the movies from your W3 onto the laptop and use the supplied software to view that content in 3D. So four main ways to enjoy the content from your W3. Uh, the first is the LCD on the back of the camera. The second is lenticular 3D prints from seehere.com. 
Uh, the third is with 3D TVs with an HDMI connection. Uh, and the fourth is with a variety of computer solutions uh, that are coming on the market these days, particularly uh, one that, uh, that we like at Fujifilm is the NVIDIA 3D Vision System. So go out and um, look into these different types of 3D content uh, output solutions and get yourself set up with one and really start enjoying the content from your FinePix Real 3D W3 digital camera.